Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer and welcome back to another Oblivion video and in this video I have a list, a note card with what I call my skills that I think are useless in Oblivion. Now first of all, useless skills are important for an RPG game because they allow you to do stupid things. I wish Oblivion had a drinking skill. I wish it so bad, but we're gonna get into this. The first skill, Blunt and Blade. I'm gonna tell you guys this right now. I think Skyrim's more elaborate system of one-handed um, blade axe mace and two-handed blade axe mace works infinitely better, okay? I think it would be cool if Oblivion, you know, I get that they want seven combat skills, seven stealth skills, and seven magic skills, but if they could have added more, I would have at least liked a one-handed or two-handed skill or a one-handed blade, one-handed blunt, two-handed blade, two-handed blunt, you know. Preferably a one-handed blade axe sword and two-handed blade axe sword skills. But you know, the blade blunt, it's like, and then you get into is blunt or blade better? And I think most people say blade is better. I don't, I'm not sure for sure. You can go ahead and answer that in the comments below. Do you prefer blade or blunt? But I just, blade blunt is not a good system. All right, second skill, athletics. All right, why not just put generate fatigue under a, like, why do you have to do this generation fatigue while running? That's all athletics does. I don't even know what the max athletics skill is because I've never gotten it before. So athletics is just running back and forth. Useless skill, it's pretty obvious. The next one, speechcraft. There's no dynamic speeches in Oblivion. Not, not even Skyrim tried but failed epically of like you could bribe guards in the right way or you could completely try to persuade them. All right, in this one it's just, oh, let me be friends with you and I might be able to yield, you might be able to yield against me. Something all speed trap does. And sometimes you have to convince and sweet talk someone into selling you a house. And the bo I don't even know what the bonuses do, okay? I don't think anyone knows what the bonuses do because, Frank, I don't, I don't even try it. I think it's like, I know Oblivion, there's actually racism in Oblivion where, like, a bunch of people hate the orcs, these people hate wood elves, so I, maybe it gets rid of your racism. I don't know. Next on this list is security. Okay, let me tell you guys this. Lockpicking as a skill, in the way they did it in Skyrim, makes sense. It's, it's like the stealing skill and lockpick skill together. This game... What are you going to do? Lockpicks? What? Lockpicks do what? What? They did? They keep the tumbler up. Well, if you play Oblivion, your, your actual lockpicking skill in real life to lockpick a lock in Oblivion gets better. Right? Then you have alteration over here with the unlocking stuff anyways. And then you have the skeleton key. It's like one of the easiest items in the world to obtain. And it's a low-level Diedrich item. So security has absolutely... Just, I mean, it has a place because, you know, you have to lockpick stuff, but they did it so bad, okay? Like, lockpicking, like, as a skill sucks in Oblivion because what is the level you can get the skeleton key at? Like, somewhere around 11 or 7 or something? I don't know. Something extremely low. You know, granted, it's hidden in the bottom of the map, but don't worry about that. Next up, I'm looking at the list right now, is Armorer. The reason why Armorer is a useless skill is because it's annoying, Okay, and we'll get to this in a little bit. It goes hand in hand with the hand to hand skill, but armor just, it's, you repair things, right? The only thing, like, stuff breaks in oblivion and it's annoying, right? It's like, oh, I have a character that can't hold stuff, but I have to carry around 30 hammers because I got to repair my crap anyways, like, like, I'm glad they took that. Honestly, I'm glad they took that out of Skyrim and replaced it with a blacksmithing skill. But put that in Oblivion. A blacksmithing skill would make so much more sense in Oblivion than a repair skill, and I think it would be cooler. Like, it would just be cooler. Okay? Cooler. So, last skill is hand-to-hand. -hand. Now, I think that hand-to-hand... -hand the only reason why it's useless is because there's no benefit to it other than you have to carry less repair hammers. 
That is why I see hand-to-hand -hand as a useless thing. I think, honestly, you know, hand-to-hand -hand could, if they're, like, hand-to-hand -hand punching people, the only reason you need hand-to-hand -hand is because by the off chance that you get disarmed, which I think is a very cool mechanic, is disarming, or that all your crap breaks, right? But I think the way that hand-to-hand -hand is implemented as a combat, as a weapon, instead of a combat event, right? Sneak is a combat, I call it a combat event. Sneak can affect combat, but it is not directly combat, right? Hand-to-hand, -hand, instead of being combat, it should be a combat event. Gra like a grappling mechanic where you can grab people, maybe make it a skill of, if you learn hand-to-hand, -hand, you can disarm people easier, you can kick people, you can take them down. That would have, I know like, I think that's a little too, for the engine they built, I think it's too complicated, but you see like, a great example of this is Kingdom Come Deliverance, right? You can grapple people, you can kick them, you can punch them and knock them out. I still think punching people is just something that's cool. I think if there is a whole, there is the arena, and then I think if there was like a boxing club, a fight club, that would be epic. But I think hand-to-hand -hand should be grappling instead of this just punch the crap out of people, right? And uh, it's a way to optimize strength training, honestly, or endurance, whatever it falls under. See, I don't even use it. I don't know. But with that being said, guys, these are the useless skills of Oblivion that I think either need to go away, get revamped, or replaced. Let me know what your least favorite skill is in Oblivion, but the one rule is it can't be athletics or speechcraft. Okay? So you can't say speechcraft or athletics because those are unanimously the most useless skills in Oblivion. I wanted you to come up with something creative. So, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games, and I will see you in the next episode, stream, vlog, or stream it, post, or whatever I decide to make.